Visionary Sciences presents the Eye Tracking Assessment and Remediation System, or ETARS. Eye Tracking uses an infrared camera to take a video of your eye movements. It can take a picture of where your eyes are focused on a screen at any one time and over time. Eye tracking research has been under development for over 25 years. It is safe, non-invasive, portable, inexpensive, quick, efficient, and incredibly accurate. It provides data about the working brain and its functioning, of which individuals are unaware. For this reason, it can be used for diagnostic, monitoring, and remediation purposes. There is a renewed interest in eye tracking recently because of the recognition of its ability to measure both normal and pathological behavior. There are many hardware companies that provide eye tracking technology. However, it is in the software and applications that cutting edge advancements are being made. Visionary Sciences has developed a proprietary software package that is the most comprehensive platform for this kind of research and service initiative. Here is what an eye tracking system we use looks like. This model has a binocular camera setting on the table under the screen. We prefer this or other non-head mounted systems as they are more accurate and less invasive. They are also better suited to the type of populations we measure, which include children, the elderly, and those with physical or other disabilities who would find head mounted devices uncomfortable or unusable. Join us now as we provide a short video demonstration of eye tracking at work. Here we have our subject seated comfortably in front of the screen and eye tracking device. A sequence of dots are presented on the screen in order to calibrate this machine for each individual subject. Once an individual's tracking ability is determined, our examiner presents a variety of stimuli to assess their attention concentration, pupil dilation, short-term memory, and other neurophysiological measures. Here are some examples of the type of data we can collect from a single picture or stimuli. ScanPath shows where an individual looked at any one time and over time. This provides immediate feedback on a person's visual tracking. This is a graphical representation of data obtained from our data mining algorithm to identify normal versus pathological states. This shows the number of focal points that the person uses over time to understand the image. You can see that many points are returned to repeatedly yielding a kind of density pattern. This is an attentional landscape that shows in 3D the salience of certain points of the stimuli over others. You can see the percent of time that individuals spend on a given area of the stimulus, which is represented as a three-dimensional model. The derived fitness landscapes from our test subjects are compared to normal and pathological groups in our databases to identify their level of concentration and executive functioning. What you have just seen is the working brain in action. Our focus, attention, concentration, etc. can be measured accurately and provide immediate results as to an individual's level of functionality. How useful would this be to a physician, parent, researcher, or patients? Using this information, a doctor could get immediate feedback in order to determine the level of damage, dysfunction, or disease that a person manifests. In a similar fashion, a doctor can determine the effectiveness of medication as well as information about treatment or remediation. Thank you for your patience with our presentation. We would now like to tell you more about Visionary Sciences, our partners, the populations we are currently working with, and the kinds of opportunities we offer you.